Hey, what's up? And welcome to a new video tutorial by Crocfix. So, today we have here two smartphones. One is an old Huawei P30 Lite and on the other side we have a brand new Samsung Galaxy S23. The question is, can we migrate all data from a broken Huawei P30 Lite to a brand new Samsung Galaxy S23? Can we transfer all the data, photos, documents, uh, call settings, uh, contacts and so on? The answer is yes, but we will need to uh, follow some procedures first. And uh, because our old phone is not working properly, touchscreen is not working, we will need to temporarily um, connect and working screen. For this, we need to first actually disassemble the phone. And then we will follow with a software transfer. So first let's start and uh, disassemble the back of this Huawei P30 Lite. Did I say P? I mean P30 Lite. Now we need to disassemble the screws here. And then we lift up this plastic here. There is another screw hidden here, where is the white spot? Now firstly I'm going to try to remove this metal plate here. This could be a little bit tricky, so let's try first with a plastic frame. Okay, and then this metal plate, we disconnect the fingerprint reader, we take away the front, uh, I mean the top plastic, disconnect the battery here, there we go, we lift up this foil. There we go, a little bit more, okay. And now we came here to the connection where the screen is connected. This needs to be dismounted, disconnected. And now let's take a new screen. Now we need a working screen connected to the connector here, to the main board. Okay, let's connect back the battery. There we go. 
Now let's try to turn on the phone. Okay, the phone is turned on. We have a picture. Let's wait the phone to boot up. So once we have here a working phone, I mean a working screen on a damaged phone, we will now proceed with the installation of the software. Firstly, we need to unlock the phone. There we go. Then we will need to connect to Wi-Fi and to go to the Play Store. Once connected to the Play Store, I try to make more brightness here. Let's go to the Play Store and download some software. So you will need the software called Samsung Switch. There we go. So that's the right one with this icon here, Samsung Switch Mobile, and let's install it. The phone is a little bit old, so, so we need to wait. There we go. Let's wait for the software to install. Okay, we can open the software. We need to uh, allow all applications and everything what the application is asking us. So, allow, allow, allow. Just a moment, I will switch to English, maybe it will be easier for you. We will switch to English also on this new device. Okay, so once we are here on English, 
we need to go again. You don't need to do that, but that's only for... That's only here for you to better understand. So click on Smart Switch, open your application, that's it. And then you will need also on the new phone the application Smart Switch. If you don't, didn't already install it, you go to Play Store, search again for Samsung Smart Switch. This one here, it's already installed, so we open it. We allow, allow, and then we wait. We click here. Let's go and there we go. So now we need to click on transfer your data. Let's go. We want to connect through wireless. And here we will click uh, receive data, Galaxy Android and wireless. Okay. So they both need to connect now to find each other. Okay. So we have the information. This is the Galaxy S23. Okay. Invitation connect to Galaxy S23, connect. Okay, so they are scanning all the applications uh, which needs to be transferred. This can take a while, so just let it do it. Okay. So what do we want to transfer? Usually click on everything. So everything will be transferred. Then we go and uh, click next. Uh, it's asking you which messages do you want to transfer? Last two years, one year, six months. I will click on all messages, transfer. And now the remaining time will calculate. It says it will take around 28 minutes. So let's see and wait. This video will now speed up a little bit. So just to let you know. If you maybe get an error and uh, it won't transfer or it says uh, connection lost, Maybe to avoid this, you could click on keep screen on and here on keep screen on. If this doesn't help, then on your old phone, disable the Wi-Fi. I mean, forget the network. You have to enable Wi-Fi, but just forget the network. So it won't connect to the Wi-Fi and tra transfer uh, new data to your old phone. I mean, if you have installed, for example, uh, Facebook, uh, Viber, uh, and the uh, incoming messages still will uh, income while you transfer the data. That could be a difficult part and maybe it could interfere. So the best is uh, forget all the Wi-Fi networks, keep the Wi-Fi on, uh, keep the screen on and let it do its job. So after a couple of attempts, uh, we succeeded. It says all done, uh, done transferring your data. So you can click here on go to home screen. Now, if you just uh, swipe down this menu, you will see it says here, organizing your, uh, your transferred data. So you need to wait until this is done and complete. And then I would suggest you to restart the phone. So after the work is done, you will see uh, data transfer complete. 
Uh, and here it will say installing apps. So probably your apps will be transferred. You need to also wait to complete this task. So after everything is finished, you will see uh, data transfer completed and no more uh, tasks are working here. Uh, I mean, no more tasks are installing. So after that, I would suggest you that you click on volume down and power button, hold these two buttons and restart your phone. And that should be it. This is basically the tutorial for transferring the data from an UAE P30 Lite to a brand new Samsung Galaxy S23. Let me know in the comments if it did work for you, if you had any issues or if you have any questions. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. If the video did somehow help you, then you can buy me a coffee. Donations are always appreciated. Thank you. You find a donation link in my about page and in the video description. Please also like, comment and share the video. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.